Hello, Dart Pivot here, and in this tutorial, I will be showing you how to get your pivot animations onto YouTube and add sound effects to them. So let's begin. First, go to Pivot, and um, hopefully, you should already have an animation made. If not, then make one. Now, uh, let me open it. Um, Let's just do. Can't show you that one. That's for my pivot thing. Um, okay, I'll just do this, I guess. Okay. This is my most recent animation, also. So, yeah, you got your animation here. Okay, now this is what you're gonna want to do. This is what you're gonna. Okay, this is what you're gonna want. <laughs> okay, here's what you want to do. Go to save animation. Go to where you want to save it. I'll just save it in my desktop for now. Click this save as type where it says dot piv. Open it and click dot gif. Now, um, name it what you want. Chipod fight and click save now you'll come to this thing click merge take that take the check off of that and where it says frame delay change this to six and where it says shrink frames by change it to two click ok now let's close pivot and you're going to go to Windows Movie Maker. If you do not know where that is, then I will show you how to get that after this. This is an old tutorial here. Okay, whatever. Okay, now. Go to Import Pictures. Go down to where you saved it and click, double click it and it will import it into here. Now, drag it into the drag media to the timeline thing, to the video on the timeline, and here you go. There's your animation. Now, this is how you're going to add sounds to it. I'm going to use a different animation that you that I used in my random stick figures too for this one because this one's a lot easier to add because I only have one sound effect to add. Go, let me get my let me get the animation here. This this might seem familiar to you. <laughs> okay, there you go. Wee! That's fun to watch. Okay. Anyway, go to import audio or music and go to your sound effects and find where it is the sound effect you want find it right here and drag it in to where you want and let's find the spot right here there it is click this magnifying button to magnify it there and yep that's good now, here's the video for it. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to, um, how to get Windows Movie Maker if you don't know where to get it. So, all you want to do is wait for this to close. I don't know why it's taking so long. Okay, go to start, go to search, go to documents, and type in Windows Movie Maker. And just keep waiting for it to search, and sooner or later, it will pop up right here, and you can drag it into your desktop or wherever you want it. I hope this has been a helpful tutorial. This has been Dark 
pivot, please subscribe to me. Um, yeah, have a nice day.